Hello and welcome fellow gamers, my name is Barak and this is another episode of 7 Days to Die Modded and we're back with more starvation, yes we're back with starvation mod and actually today we will be starting the garden project, the garden project that is a part of a bigger project called Little Kiss that I am building with a friend of mine and yes baby we will be building a garden over here all those uh, thingy jigs like uh, those brackets over here uh not brackets uh, uh pillars going up are the support for the main structure which is going to be leveled with uh the entrance that we have over here so as you can see entrance is five wide and seven blocks high that's why we will be building something like that of course it will be on the elevation i don't know if i will fill that all that uh, structure with ground or not but i will explain a bit later on how it's going to be built so first of all we need to make a connector connector between the base entrance and the garden itself so, so the connector is going to be like over here it is in a distance of three blocks from the main entrance and as you can see i've made like uh, a pillar over here that is digged into ground for safety reason and of course we will be building that one up so first of all let's build that main that main structure that will sit on those uh, uh, concrete blocks like that as usual dig everything inside i dig everything inside just inside ground just for safety reason and then of course we need to put what the hell? Oh shit! Holy fuck! God damn it! She gave me such. Oh! There's a horde coming! That's not cool! That is not cool. Of course, when I wanted to start recording, the horde had to come. But that's okay. That's okay. We can have fun time with those guys. Oh, who would you just die already? And I'm bleeding. For fuck's sake. God damn it, inside my freaking garden, the garden that I wanted to build. Well, that's okay, that's okay. Man, but that cheerleader gave me such a fright. God damn it, okay, I know I'm still bleeding. Do I have any medical assistance with me? Of course I don't. So that kind of a sucks. Probably they will, they want to destroy my base as well. Not the base, the frames that I put over here. So that definitely sucks. And probably soon crawlers will show up. Because that's what usually happens. And I'm infected! Shit! And of course that will... That will degrade my wellness as well. Why I don't have any med medical assistance with me? No idea, but fortunately... Fortunately, the bleeding already stopped, so that's good. Okay, that's good. That's more like it. Holy shit, that was so much fun. <laughs> In a way, of course. Okay, do any of you have any medical thingies with you? Because I completely don't have any whatsoever okay okay i have some storage box i i have some rain storage uh because we will be using those and quite a lot of other resources and ingredients of course i will have to take care of those things that i that are over here and i am called son of a bitch as game reminds me every single day okay so that's more like it. There's a biker over there in the distance, but I'm not gonna disturb him at all. Oh, that was so much fun. <laughs> okay, where do I have my plates? Oh, okay, over here. So of course we will be making like Harry Potter shit, like that. And let's let's start with that connector, shall we? Like that, and then we will have to go for no, that not. That, that's not right. This is right. Okay, and like so. And now, on top of those, I will make like one, two, three, four. And that should connect to the base that is going to be over there. Now, the question is... The question is that this is not going to work. So, 
So let's do something like that. And now jump without any success on the other block. That's okay. That's okay. I can deal with that. Right. Two, three, four. And connect those inside. There's going to be metal trussing. No biggie. I should be actually building like so. Because like that it's much better. And now connect those. Okay, good. So we have a connector. Connector that will connect. <laughs> you know what? It will connect. It will connect garden with the entrance. Now, those metal trussings I've made a bit more. And inside there's going to be a hatch. Because that's going to be 3x3. Three three. There's going to be a metal hatch inside that will allow me to drop on the hay bales that I need to dig down there. Now, I have quite a lot of... Oh, quite a lot of pillars to be done because those pillars will be made in the same fashion uh, the pillars pillars for the main structure are going to be two by two like that so let's build one together like so increase the elevation like that now those things that i can actually connect already to the part that is over here and copy the rotation from that one. I don't know if I copied the rotation or not, but I think I've just made a basic idea for you guys to see what I'm going to be building and how I'm going to be building those. Like that. Fairly simple. So this is one pillar. Oh, shit. Oh. So this is going to be one pillar and then I need to do the same to the to all the pillars that are going to be in on the outside. Shit, I've made something wrong over there because this is not supposed to be only on the edge. Well, I will make it later on uh, because that in that case we will have a building like a wall over here that will be four high and inside I should have made like three blocks high because this is not going to be this is this was supposed to be made for water so that thing a jig over here this block is not supposed to be in here no I'm infected I know I know no biggie like that okay Okay, and then I will connect all around, uh, all this around, and then we shall see how it's going to look. Because as I said, it will take me quite a bit of time, because as you can see, there's quite a lot of things. So over here as well, all those pillars are four uh, apart each, except for that one in the middle, because, because there is an airdrop somewhere over here. Yeah, there it is. So let me just... Oh, it's over there. Okay, so let me mark that. Let me just mark that one. Quick waypoint. No, actually save waypoint. That's going to be day 38, 40. I don't know. What day is it? Day 37. 37, 35. Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. So we will go there and then we will... Well, I will finish that. Uh, building because we have quite a lot of things to be done today as well okay uh, so as you can see in the middle i will have two supports as well and on the other side there's going to be two supports as well additional supports so as soon as i will finish uh, as soon as i will finish everything that i need to do over here i will of course let you guys know so stay tuned i'll be right just right back oh no not that Alrighty, so the basic for uh, the garden is done and as you can see it is some Harry Potter shit levitating above the ground which is quite awesome though in starvation it is a bit of a problem since uh, zombies are a bit higher than higher and smaller than usual but nevertheless it is done and as you can see I've made a lip 
all around that is four high four four bro blocks high just above those uh, plates uh, concrete plates so one two three four that is the uh, outside wall and then inside we have like three high blocks and that is going to be support uh, for the floor uh, so again another tedious job for me to do is just place down this uh, floor and as you can see i've sprained my leg while jumping on heights because well i tend to do that quite often and it is quite dangerous for me and you should know all that already that yeah heights plus borek means splinted or broken or at least sprained leg so basically yeah that's that and now what i need to do is just spend a little bit more time on building a floor over here which is quite boring i must say in terms of you know gameplay and showing showing you guys what i'm building right now i'm not the biggest fan of time lapses i know that you musical guys do enjoy that but still let's just focus on building since i'm not the greatest builder but still let's finish let's build this project and let's see how it's gonna go uh, because yeah i will continue building that project and i will continue uh, playing starvation because there's still quite a lot of things for me to discover in it uh, since i did not explore everything but as for right now i need to put down this goddamn floor so stay tuned i will be just right back Okay then, so the floor is done. Well, it's not going to be floor, it's just marked as a floor will look like, uh, because we'll have like floor with glass over here. I will need like apparently 270 blocks for that. Quite a lot of glass, but I'm still burning that one uh, in forges. Now, I need to make a place where I will put those rain catches. So according to the plan, I need to be in the center of the southern wall. This is the southern wall and this is the center. So I must mark four blocks. One, two, three, four blocks. And on the fifth, make like this square that is gonna be that is gonna be two by two. Okay. One, two, three, four. And knowing that this wall is twelve wide and twelve blocks wide, or at least uh, the floor is. So it is distant one, two, three, four, five, six from each side. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this is one block, and I think rain drop, rain water will be collected like like over here, because those rain catches are supposed to work four in each direction, up, down, and to the sides. So that's gonna be if I catch water in here. One, two, three, four. In that direction and one two three four one two three four that direction something like that so here's one square now we need to go to the northern side and do the same one two three four and five so here's a block two by two that's okay it's a big bit awkward to see uh, with all those frames around here but still that's good but here's a problem since the distance between those fill, those uh, uh, things over here are free wide i was supposed to put another block that is going to be two by two in the middle in the middle over here but that sucks that's uh, supposed to be like two by two knowing that distance from this one two three four five six seven eight and that one one two three four five five six seven and eight i think i was supposed to put like only one by two square in the middle because that would suggest to have two rain catches over here four over here and four over there i don't quite understand the description that little kiss made but still i'm gonna mark it as it is that is in the center it is in the center of the whole structure, so pretty much that's it. I know that I still have to replace that one with glass, so I will keep that one as a ongoing project, okay? And of course I need to put like fillers, draining fillers, eight of them in two rows. 
But I have absolutely no idea where to put them. If I do four, so then I would have to go like one, two, three, four. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. That would be maybe something like that in two rows. I have no idea if that is correct thing for me to do. So little kiss, please. Please correct that if I'm wrong. One, two, three, four. And then one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then this one, two, three. So that should be one, two, three. From that wall, one, two, three. And on the fourth, over here and over there. So that's four. But that doesn't make any sense. Any calculations that I do doesn't make sense whatsoever. But I think it is supposed to be connected maybe with uh, a rat repellent or insect repellent. So I will await little kiss further further instruction on how to do that because I have absolutely no idea what she had in mind and since she did not tell them, told me everything about this we will put this on hold but as you can see the structure is done so it looks quite hmm, impressive I must say but knowing that I will need quite a lot of food for my guys downstairs well that's that's how it's going to be now I'm going downstairs to the base because we will set up a NPC station in today's episode as well. So let me just get back to the station, unload everything that I have over here, and then I'll get back to you. Okay, so we're down here and I have created three stations. Mechanical, mechanic station, smith station and cook station. Fortunately, I had all the ingredients, which is not that bad to make or to gather. Well, God is quite awesome, but it doesn't do any damage whatsoever. Uh, nevertheless, uh, so I've made mechanic station by making middle lift and workbench and let's hope that I actually use proper car battery because I completely forgot about that uh, but I will be placing over here this is going to be NPC's workshop well maybe I should turn on the light yes let's use oh shit I still need to do some lightning over here huh I don't know if I have all the ingredients though hmm. yeah there's uh, there is the what do you call it a relay but if i put yeah i must think about something over here uh, now first of all we will start by making this mechanic mechanic station so uh that's going to be distant from the wall one two three four and on the fifth and three away from the station over here there's going to be a mechanic station. That's going to be one, two, three, four. And then next, um, another one will be, that's uh, five, six, seven. There's going to be some shared, shared um, storage boxes. Let me just double check that three and four from the entrance, three meters from the right. I will put him like over here. Yeah, so that is going to be mechanical station. Let's hope that one of those guys can be mechanic. Okay, first rotate him. So he will be facing a wall. Oh, actually, the guy with beard was a mechanic. So that's good. Hello, Mr. Mechanic. Did you pooped on me? Okay, I don't have any job for you. Close the crafter just for right now now another one what do we need to do put down his storage department so fifth and free whoa, whoa, what but uh, looking from the entrance leave one meter fifth on the wall was supposed to be so it, there's a passage on the six you will put so that's four that's five, that's six. That is supposed to be shared uh, storage box. And then there's going to be a fridge if needed, like over here on the seventh. And then we need to put Smith Station. Holy mother of testicles. Okay, I think I will just try and rotate him. Like that a bit. 
so he can share that storage with this guy that's gonna be one space okay you know what actually he is not supposed to be standing here but he is more like should be standing over here so I can have a look at them so I can have a look at them from my shop okay so if I do put him like that, he's not going to be in a way. But that forge is somewhat dumped what. Okay, he can be over here. That's fair enough. Okay, so we have built a mechanic. We have built um, Smith Station. So let's see what we can do. And another one is going to be a lady with a cook station but she will be built in the next episode okay so first of all i will try and give them easy jobs yeah do do fluorescent light that would be so awesome quite unfortunately that guy in order to craft stuff i can teach him hold held items like industrial lights and fluores fluorescent light but not just yet there's quite a lot of oh nail trap wrench 100 no, shotgun stock first of all he's going to be making those iron uh iron arrow head packs that will increase his level but for that i will need forged iron that i should have plenty over here and some clay let's take this one and let's actually see if he's going to be able to do anything with that if that mm, box will actually work but for that i will need some bread quite unfortunately i can hear that the guys over here is, are sick oh shit i don't have any more cornbread that's that's really bad but i have some over here so that should be okay let me just put that one over here spoiled drink i hate those fridges because if you have this Everything is just fine and over here in the fridge that is powered and needs to be connected to power everything just fucking spoils Come on game. What is it? Hmm life hacks, I guess um, Dude stop standing on those crates. This is really not nice Okay, so if I put that one over here and this one and this And lump of clay will that work for you will you work don't seem to work do you need any more any other crate? Well, somebody does have a hiccup. So maybe if I put like this over here. Will it work then? I don't know, I'm just testing. No, not fridge. You're not supposed to Oh, now he's working. Ha! Ah, yes, that is a badass smith okay yeah look at that he did a pack of iron is it iron that looked like like steel this looks like a steel to me not iron okay recipes yeah that's quite stupid no but that's okay Maybe I can just sell those things to a trader later on. On that note, that makes me wonder how much that's 18, worth 18, and that one is 14. So I guess going with those full packs is going to be a bit better. Definitely. Okay, now for the mechanic, let's see what he can do. He can do spring with some forged steel and forged iron, which fortunately I do have as well. Steampunk revolver parts, spring, short iron pipes and copper. I don't have that much copper, so we're not going to be building that. But I do have some... I do have some forged steel and uh, forged iron. So I wonder if I put that one over here, those things over here, if they can share. Will that work for you? spring go and do some spring for me oh dude you're gonna burn yourself for fuck's sake what a dumb twat what about food 
Are they eating something? No idea. Don't mind me. I wanted to take this, actually. If somebody is actually sick, then... Okay, so he's not working. So I'm gonna take that still with me and put it over here. Ah, now he's working. Yes. Do all that CNC shit for me, please. And springs will come in hand later on. I wonder how much material he has to use in order to advance. Okay, here. Yeah, already went into level 1, so that's good. That's really good. And then you will be making wrenches for me. And the machete, look at that! All I need to do is show him how to make a machete. 100 level, well, it's still crap, but it's better than nothing. Of course, I can... I will lose some material on that, but that's okay. That's okay. He's making... He's making springs. Yes, he already made two, so that's good. And you know what? On that note, I'm taking a girl that will be sitting right, like right next over here and she will make me she will be making me some food because she's going on the girl. Follow me. I don't know if that's gonna be the girl or the lady who is supposed to be working in a cook station. But let's hope that actually she is the one. If not, well then shit hits the fan. Okay, in here. Come on. The opening is wide enough. Now, cook station. Rotate it like so. A bit closer. There's gonna be fridge if needed. Yeah, she actually did work. Just great. Okay, now... Uh, she doesn't know how to do anything. So let's take this. Use cook station, teach item and cornbread. She can do cornbread out of bottled water and cornmeal. And let's see if I have any. Any whatsoever. I should have some water with me, so that shouldn't be a problem. But cornmeal, on the other hand, no idea. Okay, corn seeds. I have plenty of corn seeds because I've um, got few. But quite unfortunately, I don't have any corn left. There's some cornmeal, okay. So I'll take all that with me, and uh, that actually also makes me wonder if she can cook water. Come on, come on, come on. Let's do that like that. Let's now take some water. Let's take some water, and then I'll try to teach her something. No, that's good. Cornbread, current what current. Now this, will you... Nope, you can't do that. Now bottled water, can you like cook water? Uh, nope. That sucks. But I guess if I put this and this over here... Will you cook? It doesn't supposed to be working now? Or do you really need additional storage? What the hell? Oh yeah, they all went into sleep. That's just great, because of the night time. Lazy bums for fuck's sake. I'm the one who is doing all the hard work over here and they don't do anything. What a dumb what's. Okay, so I guess she will wake up in the morning and find out Holy shit, there's so much work that I need to do for that guy. That's a shame. Okay, last but not least, I know it's getting a bit long today. But I will be putting... I will put this jail door... <laughs> over here like that. But I don't know... 
Yeah, that was stupid. Because I actually should put it over there. Can I like <laughs> pick it up? Maybe I can actually pick it up. Okay, because I want to put those jail doors, but they need to open in the center of the tunnel since it is free white. Not like that. Not like that. I must check if I can pick them up. If not, then I will have to destroy it. Nevertheless, guys, that's going to be it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment about the gameplay, subscribe to the channel if you're new and you like what you see. And I hope that we'll see each other in the next episode. So, till then, take it easy, have fun, and happy gaming. I wonder if that still works. Can I pick this one up? No. Mm. Shit.